Hey guys, welcome to my shadows. This is going to be the Lilith Strength and Confidence Ceremony. As you can see, we have flowers here, the crystals. Underneath is the petition with the herbs and the offering. Under all of these rose petals here with the witch's bird. I also have the incense going. We have the Lilith candles, a silver and black to represent the goddess Lilith feminine energy, black for protection. This is the special Lilith candle that I have here for her, as well as all of your guys' candles. Alright guys, so I've started the candle as you can see. The back row here, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, and then L and M. So these are the candles, they are in progress. We have the silver and black here with Lilith's name on it. The black one indicates protection, harm to none. We have the desert rose, some obsidian, green garnet, regular garnet. We have selenite. The petitions are underneath there. That also says thank you Lilith with the rose petals, the witch's burr. I also have a bell here as well that I was ringing prior to it. So I'm gonna ring it again. And I also have a feather to represent intuition and wisdom here. So thank you everyone who participated in the candle ceremony for Lilith. You can see the flames can get pretty high at times, which is a really good strong sign. I'm also getting a lot of you guys are intuitive or gifted because these on the far right are high flames and they are connected. So I feel like you guys could be a set of chosen ones here, which is really good, beautiful energy. And then this is Lil's candle that's currently burning here. I do apologize for the background music. My neighbors are having a party, so, which makes sense because I know Lilith loves to be free, rebellious, and just have that freedom, independence, loves music, so I think it's perfect that there is some type of music in the background. But I have all of your candles in the petitions. Feel free to reach out to Lilith when you watch this and say thank you. If you didn't read my email with your candle letter until after the fact, that's okay. The candle letters are A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, and M, like Mom, Mary, Martha. So those are your candles here. If you're looking at this video after the fact and you were like, oh shoot, I didn't get my petition in, strength and confidence is the main request here for these candles as well as success, prosperity, abundance love motivation these two candles are specific to lilith as a form of gratitude to protect our space and then we have this one here that i don't really want to put on there too much but it is the specific lilith candle it's made out of beeswax that i ordered special for her and the desert rose which represents maybe you guys have been through a lot but you have overcome this challenge that you faced in the past because you guys are strong you have overcome something that was very hard to deal with, but you nonetheless are still alive, breathing, moving forward, motivated and focused on yourself. Just like Lilith felt like a rebel or was casted out, didn't feel loved. Maybe you guys have felt like this, but you guys are definitely healing, moving forward. 
and Lilith will give you the strength and motivation to achieve your goals, your dreams, your passions, your desires, that which you want the most. So thank you, Lilith, for allowing me to do this ceremony for all that participated. And may those who participated be protected, harm to none. And may we receive the intuitive blessings and messages, angel number 444, that we are meant to have from the beautiful goddess Lilith herself. This is such peaceful energy, you guys. Like, I wish you could feel it. Hopefully some of you guys can feel it through the video, but the energy is so calm. It's just, it's a really beautiful, peaceful energy. I love it. And even the way this candle is burning, do you see how the beeswax is just kind of dripping down the center? I feel like she's clearing a path and removing a blockage of some sort, which is really good energy. And I did say very specifically that I do not want to harm anyone during this candle ceremony, harm to no one, as we focus on positive healing energy. And the offerings are here for Lilith, so thank you, Lilith. I really do feel she has heard us. 555 angel number, as I was saying that. I wish the lighting was a little bit better, but it's not that great. But nonetheless, I feel like the candles, to me, the candles are kind of looking, I don't know why I heard cherry tomatoes or like strawberries or like some aphrodisiac type of energy, but it's because Lilith is very sensual, very passionate, fiery. It's all about love and feeling that passion, that motivation, that desire. So for you guys to feel loved and feel beautiful to love your body, mind, and spirit in every way, shape, and form. She will help you find your self-love, healing, and peace so that you feel accepted through the energy of Lilith and to be confident and to just be who you are. So feel free to say thank you to Lilith after you watch this video or while you are watching it. You can light your own candle at home and say a prayer or just a small thank you to her play some music for Lilith. She does love music. And just feeling wild and free. You can even take a drink in honor of Lilith. I did not put it here because I was a little bit hesitant of putting some type of alcohol with the fire of all these candles, but I will definitely put something out for Lilith after the fact. With the petition, I will be tearing that up and burying it in the earth so that it can manifest. And even here, I don't know if you guys can see, it looks like there's a face. Do you see that? I feel like that's Lilith's protection. Spirits that are also here around us, helping us to manifest these things that we've all asked for. seems to be burning really well it's just really beautiful energy you guys thank you all who participated i am honored that you trust me to do these candle ceremonies for you it truly does mean a lot to me and i'm so grateful that lilith accepted and allowed me to light these candles i did dream of a snake last night which i felt was definitely confirmation from lilith that it's okay to do this ceremony because I was questioning myself if it was the right thing to do and I feel like she has told me yes through the dream so for that I'm truly grateful and on these petitions that are hidden under the crystals and herbs I did say um I did write thank you Lilith on there let's see if I can show you guys hopefully I don't drop anything it's in there <laughs> it says thank you Lilith and then underneath that paper are the petitions because I didn't want it to show on camera. 
just for privacy, right? So that is the ceremony, you guys. I send you many blessings. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. It means a lot to me. Please like and subscribe. Let me know if you have any dreams or receive any type of messages from Lilith after the ceremony. I will continue to burn these candles until they burn all the way down. Definitely expressing my gratitude to Lilith, as I'm sure you all are as well. Thank you all for participating and I send you many blessings. Thanks guys. Bye.